All right, welcome back. Uh, today I'm going to be inking Wonder Woman. Uh, this is a art commission that I'm doing for Lake Como, uh, Lake Como Comic Art Festival in Lake Como, Italy this week. So this is one of the art commissions. So I haven't drawn Wonder Woman in a while. Um, I'm actually currently on uh, Harley Quinn. So this was actually a fun little um, um, fun little thing for me since I haven't drawn her in a while. So as you can see, I've already drawn pencil the entire thing, uh, and I am gonna ink it. So um, I've only got a very short time. Uh, Fifteen minutes. Uh, GoPro will will chop it. Uh, will chop the video in half. If it goes beyond 15 minutes so i'm gonna try to do as much as possible within 15 minutes so as always i will be inking with a micron let's start i always like to start with the face So she has a very Linda Carter, Linda Carter look about her. So I discovered Linda Carter when I was in uh, in the first grade, and she pretty much defined uh, what a woman should look like for me at a very young age, and. Uh, Pretty much most of my women look like Linda Carter to a certain degree. Alright, so... Again, the camera will be a little shaky because, uh... It's connected directly to my drafting table, so every time I draw and move, uh, the uh, the vibration is picked up by the camera. So when I draw, I like to have some music on. Um, so I actually listen to a lot of classical music. Uh, I guess depending on my mood. Uh, so, I do a lot of classical music and uh, a lot of bluegrass uh, and a lot of 80s rock. Alright, so essentially at this point I'm just outlining. I might do the face last uh, because it's such an intricate thing. So I'm blind as a bat without my glasses. So, um,. Usually, uh, I have my face really right up against the paper when I draw. I draw our ink. So, the guy who commissioned me this Wonder Woman piece wanted Wonder Woman in her um, latest uh, rebirth costume. Very 
right here's the tricky part because I will be uh, inking the face so you need like a real steady hand when you ink the face because if you screw up you're screwed. So you guys don't know that my face is literally right next to the paper. Um, just right out of the... Uh, camera so when I draw Wonder Woman uh, I try to make her look physically uh, impressive um, I, I never I never thought Wonder Woman should look like a, uh, a skinny supermodel like Twiggy like it's like a stick I wanted her to, uh, when I draw Wonder Woman, I actually envision her as like a more of a uh, CrossFit type uh, body. So. Okay, so I'm going to ink the hair, and uh, I usually use a Micron uh, brush pen. So the light source is coming from here, so I try to have all the, uh, as I get lower, to make it darker. The reason I'm getting such a soft, uh, feathery brush stroke is uh, this pen is kind of half dry, so it it has a nice uh, feathery. Feathery strokes. Every time there's a bend in the wave, um, that should be the, the lightest, the lightest point is where the highlight is. I'm kind of rushing through this a little bit um, because of the time factor. Again, I don't want this video to be chopped up uh, into two parts uh, by the GoPro program.
So what I do later is um, I'll go in with uh, with my uh, pro white with my pro white, and then basically uh, add extra highlights. So I'm not going to do the eyeballs because uh, I really need to be really, really um, close up to the paper. And then my giant head will be blocking uh, most of that. part about comics is every time I get used to a costume uh, they go and change it in the olden days uh, they used to be very hyper strict about um, about costumes, about the consistency of the costumes. So they used to have uh, uh, the art director would be uh, in office uh, making sure that everyone follows the model sheet and uh, make sure everything's on model. But nowadays, um, things are a little bit more loosey-goosey uh, because they're constantly changing costumes like every couple of months it seems like. So yeah, so this is, uh, uh, my time is running out. So this, this is a nice point to stop. So, um, so this is Wonder Woman, um, in her new 50, not 52, uh, in, the, in her new rebirth costume. And I hope you learn a thing or two, uh, about inking, especially the hair. And I will see you next time. Thank you for watching.